environmental and economic benefits. Turbines have become a viable alternative to fossil or nuclear power plants for generating electrical power. Attempt to boost the output of wind turbines, while also making them more commercial and reliable. Wind energy use is a development of wind turbine technology. Wind energy technology is expected to be durable for power generation within the next two to three decades. This work gives a mathematical model and simulation of an induction generator based wind turbine. In MATLAB slash Simulink, the proposed model, dynamic simulation, and simulation results are tested. This work also includes the measurement. Wind turbines is designed to convert the wind energy into electric energy. The wind turbine system consists of three main parts, which is the rotor, that includes the blades, to convert wind energy to low-speed rotational energy. The second part is the generator, which includes the electrical generator, that include all control circuits with gearbox, that convert the rotational low speed into electric power and finally the structure, that hold all the previous components and that is the tower and nacelle. We used four inputs to the wind turbine system, which is a radio. We set the radio to 1.92431 the wind speed to 12, the beta to 0, and the vega to 50.775. And for the wind turbine's output was power and torque. All of the blocks that we employ are visible inside the wind turbine subsystem. Multiplexers are employed for air density, velocity raised to 3, area swept, and performance coefficient. One function is set to U12 and the other function is set to U13. The gain 1 parameter was set to pi, and the gain parameter was set to 1 half. A signal's upper and lower boundaries are imposed by saturation. The diagram that we use in the subsystem, which is multiplexer and function, is contained within the lambda and beta. The function 1 was set to 1 slash u1 plus 0.08 times u2, minus 0.035 slash times, 1 plus u2, raised to 3, and the function the formula was used is 0.5 times, 116 times u1, minus 0.4 times u2, minus 5, times x minus 21 times u1. The power will be 5050 when we are on the system in MATLAB Simulink, and the torque will be 0.01005 when we measure the force to rotate along an axis.